the Botanical Gardens in KL. Um, not sure where I'm going, not sure where I'm walking. I feel like I'm going to get lost because that's what I do, but let's check it out. in a cute little bamboo basket there's some local kids down there having a good time um, but yeah I'm in a cute little tree house type of situation I need to do some journaling I haven't journaled I haven't journaled at all since I left the UK I need to do that because I've been feeling a bit out of whack a bit out of sorts um, I think this is what I needed. A little bit of tranquility. I'm just way, way behind. I'm still operating on UK time, which is mad considering I've been to South Africa. Now I'm here and I still can't get my shit together. Let me just show you the views. I am in the bougie part of town now, the bougie part of Kuala Lumpur. So let's take a look and walk. Okay, so we made it to the Billion Shopping Mall. It's huge. Huge, huge mall. Almost like a tourist destination here. So let's, let's have a look around. Oh, they've got Cartier, they've got Prada. This area is giving very much New York. Very, very much New York. It's heavily inspired, you can tell. But it's amazing. Um, everyone looks hot, hot stuff. Um, so it's fun. Ah. This is why I haven't been to uh, the Patronus Towers because already I'm like, this is high. Monkey. Let's go. Top notch, a top notch uh, shopping mall. I said it's like basic, but it's not. It's top notch. Ooh, lighting. Oh, they've got JD Sports here. Wow. so this is what we'll be recording but yeah I made it to the suburbs so I'm in Dessa Park City and it's beautiful I'm by a place called the waterfront and it's a Sunday and it's pretty busy there's a lot of restaurants and shops and people walking about so very very cute so nice and peaceful and calm lots of cute dogs um, walking around and the dog person but there's a lot of cute dogs here those rich dogs this does seem like quite an affluent suburb but in terms of livability it's much better than central kl in my opinion because i feel like the hustle and bustle i'm, I'm moving away from that i'm trying to get away from that hence why i'm moving away from london 
Um, so this area seemed very nice to live. And obviously go in KL for turn up and nightlife and culture. Oh, there's fish in the water. Yeah, this seems like a really nice area. But they've kind of got everything here that you would need. And obviously you go to like the big malls in KL for you too. It's about a half an hour drive from, you know, the Pavilion Shopping Mall. So not too bad. Let's take a walk around. Sorry if the footage isn't all that. As I said, I left my camera back at home, but I have my phone and you know what, you know what iPhones are like with low lighting. So we're going to give it a go. There's obviously still not as much black people. <laughs> well, there's not any. But yes, I mean, people obviously look because I don't think they're used to seeing black people, but it's not the same as that I found in KL where people are just like staring in your grill. Something that I'm finding very cute is that like when I'm having dinner, obviously I'm alone. Um, so a lot of people come to tent, like the waiters and stuff like, they talk to you and keep you company and like, oh, are you okay? Are you waiting for anybody? Do you need anything? Where are you from? And they have good conversations and they remember your name. Oh, it's getting dark. You might not be able to see me, but you can hear me. Difference there from South Africa in terms of kind of that hospitality. Um, oh. <laughs> oh, <laughs> there's a little kid and you're like, you know, when kids are walking, you don't know where to go. Yeah, around is nice. People are just jogging in the evening. I feel like here is what I'm talking about in terms of work-life balance. Like, I feel like I could be here and this would make sense to live somewhere like this. I think this area is quite expensive. Like just the safety aspect. It's not that late. It's not as late as it looks. It's about 7 p.m. Um, but even the safety aspect, like there's lots of families out. Don't feel unsafe around here. You can kind of see cameras. There's a lot going on, there's a lot going on. Where I'm about to walk seems quite quiet now, but still, I don't feel unsafe, no offense. If I was in London, um, I wouldn't be walking, oh, thanks lighting. <laughs> if it was in London, I wouldn't be walking around a park when it's this dark, um, but here it feels fine. Don't feel sketchy. So around here is ticking a lot of boxes. I can be your, be your baby. I can Have fun, lost my 